A couple years ago, God spoke to us and told us to leave the church where we were serving as executive pastors, and He put it in our hearts to move to Florida, ironically enough, from Maryland where we were uh, living at that time. We didn't really know what He had next for us at the time we were running our business, and we uprooted everything and we went down to Florida by faith, believing that God was still not done with us as it relates to ministry. and. He still had a plan for us. While we were in Florida, we experienced a lot of hardship with the business, trying to grow it. We had plenty of work. We didn't have barely any workers. While we were down there in the midst of the stress, financial pressure, God spoke to us and said that it was time to plant a church. Automatically, my mind went to the traditional way that we would think a church should be planted. We have to find a location. We have to send out flyers. We have to invite people. But one day we were praying about it and God spoke very specifically that we were supposed to look for a house that had land on it and that we were going to actually build a facility that would be a broadcast location. Not for people to come and join and have actual members in the building, but that it would be a live stream location where we would be able to preach the Word of God all over the world. That was kind of crazy to us, especially in the midst of not having much money. We had been pouring our, our savings into the business. So at that time we were looking for a house, actually half the price of the one that God spoke to us to buy. And so it was a very big leap of faith to step out and say, okay, God, if you're speaking this, well, number one, we're gonna know that God is speaking if he's able to provide a location where all of this is gonna happen. But he spoke it very clearly to us and we knew in our hearts that he was gonna do it. And so I'm standing currently at that location that God spoke to us about. This is uh, our property that he gave us. It's got almost five acres of land and I'm standing right here in the woods where we are going to clear out a location here and actually build a studio where we will broadcast live services. Circle Church is not at all what we thought it was going to look like when God called us to plant a church, but here we are on our property that God has called us to build a broadcast location. And so instead of going the traditional route of starting live campuses where we have people come, God has spoken to us and told us to plant a broadcast location where we're gonna be able to get the word and the hope of Jesus Christ out. I have a strong conviction that the services need to be live and that the Holy Spirit needs to have full rule and reign to be able to move in these services however he wants to do it. And we wanna ask you to partner with us, not the way that you would think, because normally this is the time when I would go over the numbers and all the budget for this building and, and, and the equipment and the cameras and all of the things that we need to make this a reality, but I'm not gonna do that. We, we felt very strongly like God was saying, don't ask for money, ask for prayer support. We're a young family right now. We have two small children and clearly another one on the way. And so this is a time in our lives that is a time of stretching and is not the most comfortable time to step out in faith and do what God has called us to do. And so besides asking you to partner with us in prayer, I wanna encourage you, if God is speaking to you right now to do something or to step out of your comfort zone and it's making you nervous or you're trying to figure it out, don't. Just do whatever He's calling you to do. God knows what's best. And I just wanna encourage you, let this story that we're sharing with you today be motivation for you to step out and do whatever He's telling you to do. A couple years ago, we were doing pretty good financially. We had our business going, we had a full-time salary. In our minds and in our intellect, that would have been the time to plant the church. But we realize now all of these things had to unfold. We have multiple investments that we're working on right now. So literally, we've emptied our bank account and, and we're probably in the worst financial situation that we've ever been in. But we know that it's God because if we had started this in the time of abundance, in the time of surplus, in the time of more than enough, could we have really looked back on it and said, you know what, God did this. And so I believe that's why God has brought us to this moment because we have to step out in faith to walk into what He's called us to do. And so that's what we're asking for you today, that you will partner with us in prayer, declaring that this church, Circle Church, will go forth and be everything that God has called it to be. We're so excited about this next season of our lives that God is calling us to. Thank you for your time. Thank you for being willing to partner with us and pray with us, and not just pray, but really believe and declare that heaven will be on earth, that people are gonna to have their lives changed and that people are going to experience Jesus Christ and the hope that he will bring into their lives. 